is Stephanie and I am calling this video, are you going to take the red pill or are you going to take the blue pill? Which one? So I'm sure you've seen the Matrix movie, you know what I'm talking about. In yoga, uh, I, you know, I'll say to people, a class, if I get a lot of people in a class, and I'll say, do the standing splits. And a lot of people just go into automatic pilot with the standing splits. They were gymnasts or dancers, or they're just really flexible. Or they've done the Ashtanga series, you know, how many times over or whatever. And, you know, you say, do a standing split. And they give me the blue pill version of it. Okay. We've all seen these things dozens of times. Right. And I'm just doing this. Out of bendiness. Okay, so it's really blue pill. You know, there's not, there's not a lot going on. Great, super. Or do you want to do the red pill version of it? So the red pill version of the standing splits, stand on one leg, grab the outside of your opposite foot. So here I'm standing on my right leg, I grab the outside of my left foot. I'm not sure which is the best angle here. And instead of just getting my leg up, straightening it up, I'm going to, to work a little more consciously. I'm gonna build a little more resistance in my body. I'm going to build some guidance in it. So it's much more of a red pill experience and I'm getting new insights. I'm making new connections about the body and what some of these energy centers mean. So for this one, it's really the root chakra here. It's the tailbone, it's the base of the spine and I'm bending the standing leg bending the standing leg. And instead of letting this left leg shoot up, I'm gonna work from below upward. So I'm building a little bit more strength into it as opposed to just flexibility. And especially for you out there who are really hypermobile and really super elastic, I really recommend the red pill version for some of this stuff because, you know, you're not going to know, you're going to be building ultimately strength into what you already have. Okay, so I'm doing the other side. So bend the right, left leg. I've already got this resistance. And feel that connection with the base of the spine. Curl the hips under. Curl the hips under. And it's from the bottom, so roots to shoots. It's this really driving willpower to get the leg up and then ultimately grab a hold of it with your toes. You get the idea. So anyway, practice this. If you, again, one of these poses you've been doing for a long time, you wanna do with a little more consciousness, this is one to do. Thank you.